people on the planet. Exactly, <laughs> man. So they start off FD. Um, interesting. I'm not even going to try to understand the thought process behind striking for Marth Samus. Mm -hmm. It's just not, not where I'm at. Um, but for sure, I understand why um, both players would want to kind of simplify what's going to happen. Sure. So that up throw there from Rishi, you see that he didn't go for anything immediately afterwards. Marth doesn't have anything guaranteed on Samus, but what you're trying to exploit is that Samus has a hard time landing, and uh, there's no one better at ju juggling than Marth. Yeah, it's it's kind of that like death by a thousand cuts mm -hmm. type style. Um, as cliche as it might sound, it's really <laughs> that's really the best way to understand this matchup. Yep. Um, because you will get your small combos, as you see there. You got two fares. Um, mm. But what Samus has, what what Samus lacks in the neutral game is obviously the, that explosive, hard hitting down smash or, or um, you know wow. strong hit forward smash <laughs> like all these all these things that uh marth has but it's a little harder for him to connect that's what hugs is going to be looking for sure to rishi who's really want to do these extended edge guards and, and i guess that kind of blows a hole in my whole theory but i i think the spacing at the edge has been really interesting from both players you've seen rishi space around up tilts from hugo uh, several times now, and then that tipper right there was really nice, but also the forward smash that got Hugs the first stock was very, very well spaced as well. Yeah. So I'm, I'm intrigued to see how that develops throughout this set. And yeah, we're, we're going to probably see a lot of just very professional level spacing, mm -hmm. um, especially from two characters that kind of need that. Rely on it. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, yeah, see, the, the options that these two have been picking at the ledge have been just very different every single time. I really do like the down smash. It didn't work, but the down smash from Marth, it's really quick, it's yeah. very long. Rishi and I were talking about pivot down smash a bit uh, last week, and then he pulled it out for a kill on Foxy Grandpa. <laughs> so, possibly something here. Nice. Wow. Not the easiest thing in the world to get. No, that certainly not. That kill. Ooh. I like that. That could have set up for a nice little edge guard. Yeah, definitely would have killed, wouldn't have killed Samus, but could have turned into something really big. Right. Yeah. What are you going to do against that, you know? Yep. This has been so neck and neck the entire time. Yeah, this is like, it's a little bit of slower melee, but it's some juicy melee. Like, mm. these guys are really, they really know what they're doing. Rishi just letting Hugo come out of the corner there. Not that time. Nice. He finally gets the charge shot, which is a lot of what Rishi was looking for there was just, can I get Hugo to blow his charge shot? Right. It's so much less scary now. They've thrown that forward smash out a little early, but still a big lead from Rishi here. He just kind of, these, these leads come out of nowhere. These big percentages are, I think he threw maybe 10 down tilts the entire stock. Now it's really paying off. Yeah, and of course, percent so huge in this matchup. Yeah. Where it, it's so hard sometimes to get it. Is that going to kill? Yeah, great yeah. stuff from Rishi. Some tough tech, too. Dash back out of crouch. Yeah. Oh, that's, true, true. That's some stuff. Okay, what can Hugo do with this grab? Not a whole lot. He's going to get grabbed himself. Wow, such good spacing. Oh, and the mix-up with the Tomahawk. Oh, Rishi's moving a little bit now. Yeah, for real. You don't get to show yourself moving a lot in this matchup sometimes, but uh, Rishi definitely trying to show his stuff. Okay, Hugs doing the patented grab out of nowhere. That's definitely a Hugs thing right there, but he didn't get the full punish he wanted, and, and now Rishi is, is still living. I mean, throw to it all you want. He needs to die. There we go. There it is. And Hugo spent some time charging there, so he's going to have a full charge shot. Yeah, Rishi looking for the roll in a lot, I think, and Hugo not biting. Yeah, Hug still. Oh, he wanted to grab ledge. Okay, he's back. Oh, well, there goes the charge shot. Yeah, nice shot. See ya. Sure. Rishi with the big old lead, not taking any percent in this last stock. Okay, yeah, he can definitely grab that at that low percent. I think Hugs is not too upset about that. Oh! 
Okay, he's back to center. This is what he's been fighting for for the last, like, 30 seconds. Yeah, but uh, then Rishi kind of pushes him on the other edge, so... It's just good understanding of what is a winning situation. Hugs just picking... Ooh, Weird. that's tough. That's a really difficult situation as Marsh to get a confirm. That was the only option he had. Yeah, it was also very unclear, I think, which way was correct DI for yeah. for Hugs. Yep. Because of the weird hurt box on Samus, and it wasn't clear whether Rishi was going for which side he was going to be on when he upbeat. Right. So uh, you saw a pretty bad DI from Hugs there. For sure. Because of that. But I, I don't think it was by any fault of him. I think it was just a hard thing to read. And here we go, game two. That, that first game was, uh, that was a lot. Yeah. They, yeah. they really uh, gave nothing to the other person. Like, every every single hit felt so earned. Mm -hmm. uh, love that grab. I just love Samus' grab. Yeah, and, and Hugs' grabs have been really, really good so far, except for that last one there where it cost him the game. They've been getting him <laughs> a lot. <laughs> but hey, man, that's one of the risks you take. Yeah, for sure. He, he had a big hole to fight out of, and he almost did it. Wow, barely missing the timing on that up tilt, getting punished for it, <gasps> but reversing. No jump. Yeah, yeah he's just dead because he went for that up B. Yeah. So Rishi, kind of a huge mistake there. When, when you're in an advantage against someone at Hugs' level, if you don't fully do it correctly, yeah. you're going to get killed, man. Oh, whoa, what a, what a pick up there from Rishi. Yeah, speaking of doing it correctly. <laughs> Man, Rishi's dash dances around these uh, stationary moves Samus has have been very, very good for him. Yep. He's never in camp territory, Rishi. Yeah, true. He's never getting to the point where Samus gets the advantage again. He's staying in the sweet spot. Nice power shield. I, I really like that forward smash. It completely missed up smash. Interesting. It's working out. I actually... I sort of, I, I get it. I get the up smash. Because the sour spot maybe is one of the weaker moves that you have that can actually lead into something at that point. Rishi's been using that a lot recently. That third hit side B for kills and stuff. Yeah, it's a strong, strong trajectory. Okay, Hugs getting back to stage, dodging all those down tilts. Oh, nice cross up there. Yeah, look at this ledge play has been just absolutely one of the defining points of this set so far. Yep. Rishi picking up a little up tilt for the kill. Not a huge lead yet, but I think if he gets 40%, he's really happy. Oh, man. And he, I, it might get more than that right now. Yeah. Th this is a good stock. Wow. This is a great stock. Hugs' uh, grabs that I was praising so much not quite working out right now. Okay. Oh, okay, we'll take it. We'll take is it. Is something wrong with the setups? Are people... Is there a <laughs> curse going on? Hey, hey, don't say that. Okay, well, sorry. Didn't mean to, to <laughs> jinx the curse. <laughs> I... I... That charge shot, I don't know how much faith I have in it right now, to be honest. <laughs> And I don't, I don't say that just because, you know, the hugs, nice shot stuff. It's just in this set specifically, Rishi plays so patient once that comes out. Yep. Yeah. I like he just kind of dashed back. I felt like he knew it was coming. Mm -hmm. Getting a lot of these hits. Forward Ooh. air is not going to do much, but double bomb. Good amount of percent is added. And, and just like that, hugs honestly a couple hits away from just taking a stock. Oh. Okay, double jump's gone. Yep. Oh, he gets around the bomb. That's the that's the Hugo patented edge guard right there. The bomb right there yeah. to make you fall, and then he kills you when you early up B afterwards. Oh wow, so patient there, knowing Rishi shield had Rishi had to do something because his shield was so low. And Hugs is just nickel and diming back into this game, really just kind of putting himself in situations where yeah, he might get hit. But he's not dying. There we go. Woo. That's what he was going for last time, right? Super clean. And then if you early up B, then uh, then you just die anyways, because he he nares you. Right. Hugs has the lead, man. Yeah. Good stuff. Okay, we're going to dead even right now. Yeah. Because Marth got the last kill, there's no charge shot. Don't know how much of a difference that would make, but uh. Okay, 27% off of a grab. 
pretty good. Yeah, for this matchup, that's not bad. Rishi's been very um, tricky with the different ways he's choosing to deal with projectiles. As Hugs, I don't know whether I'm facing someone who is now just in neutral because they clanked with it, or if the power shield is coming, right? And it's a completely different reaction. Right. <gasps> Down? Oh, yeah, we all knew. Yeah. He oh. just grabbed him out of roll. Yeah, it was definitely an unintentional roll from Hugs right there. Wanted a wave dash out of shield, most likely. Tough spot for Hugs at the ledge. With aerial interrupt. Was Tanks. that an aerial interrupt? I don't know. That's not it. Okay, Hugs. Tough position, but Samus. Oh, he's is that it. Oh, oh, my God. This is crazy. Okay, down smash. Yep. Rishi goes nowhere with that DI. Yeah. Literally just gets to drift back to stage. These guys are almost dead even percent. The charge shot is here now. Oh, come on, Hugo. If there's ever a time to hit it, yeah. this is when you want it, it right? Will kill. Rishi gets a grab. Uh, we oh! all knew he was shooting it there, right? And yeah, it didn't just, even go over the yeah, stage. It was it was nothing. <laughs> that charge shot covered nothing. Ooh. They just keep almost hitting each other. Yeah. Okay. okay. Grab's Forward not going to give him really anything. But yeah, but it gives him positioning, right? right. Great recovery from Hugs. And that forwarder Ooh, still pops up. Super patient Nair getting the strong hit. Oh, my God. What a recovery <laughs> from Rishi. Dude, I'm bugging out. <laughs> this is this is the craziest minute oh, half. Oh, this is so scary from Hugs. Rishi's shield should be back now. Yeah, power, power shield. shield. But Hugs knew it was coming. But, but the, the, the shield Sims damage from the missile let the down tilt shield poke. Oh, okay, so he needs to up B only. He's going to have to up B, no right? No more tether. Rishi knows. Rishi's waiting. Oh, that's it. Wow. wow. Gets the strong hit. And the most patient of edge guards, Rishi closes it out. Yeah, that, pa I'm so, that power shield was so good because when that missile hits, Hugo's shield goes so low that unless you angle, the down tilt's going to shield poke, and Rishi knows at this point a down tilt is enough to send even big old beefy Samus off stage. Yeah, it was a really casual power shield, Yeah, but it was a crucial power shield, mm -hmm. and that's just that's just where Rishi's at, man. Yeah, because Hugs obviously... Again? Yeah. He just starts off with the power shield! Yeah, and, and Hugs knows that it's coming, too. That's why you see him shielding in return. Yeah, it, it just changes everything. Once you once you show that you have the power shield, just Sam's is so much less comfortable, man. It all comes down to comfort. What what can Hugs reasonably pull off in the matchup? Yeah. And uh, that was that was like a six minute game. Yeah, um, it was. And we might be in store for another. No jump right now on the Samus. Okay, gets down with the lazy boy there. So we all know Hugs is a player that um, he probably has some of the best stamina out of anyone in the oh, scene. Oh, for sure. So there's no doubt in my mind that he could pull this all back. Yeah, I, I agree. But, you know, I think Rishi's got a lot of stamina, too. And yeah. something he was talking to me about, one thing he's been working on, he was talking to his brother, Laud. And Laud said that his biggest weakness as a player is that he doesn't start trying until the very end when he's about to lose. Um, and that's I think that's... Laud who Rishi? Laud says that about Rishi. Wow. About Rishi. And I think that's why we see so many insane comeback and like last stock scenarios from Rishi. Yeah. Because that's really when he's operating at his full potential. So what does that mean <laughs> if he's up? I just, it means that Hugs has still got layers to go through, I guess. Yeah man, this is this is Vegeta with the bracelets. Like he's gotta he's gotta go through a little more. <laughs> Big percent. Uh, Sam is not the same trouble that Marth has, but Rishi looking just just attack some percent on. That's not gonna kill. No, it's not. There's the bomb. Oh, there's layers. There's levels to it. I feel like a Nair from Hugs would have been better in every way than that forward air. <laughs> yeah. Um, I wasn't going to say it, but you're but right. But he's still going to close it out. I mean, okay. Ah, he hit one. Yeah, he hit one. He got percent. That's big. I mean, look, it tied it up, right? No, it's huge. It's actually huge. Oh, Hugs has not been hit in a while. Yeah. He's been winning the spacing war right now. Oh, Ooh. my God. Look at this spacing. Okay. Okay. Wow, Hugs. Hugs. He's going to shoot it. Yep. Yep, and that's it. It's so hard for Marth right there. There's yeah. really, like you said, no way to get around it once you've used your jump. Yeah, And sure. your first side B. So, Hugs showing some signs of life. Um... I think it's the first first big lead. I'm not sure if it's the first lead at all, but 
definitely the first time the I first can remember. Sizable one, this, yeah. this set feels like it's been going on forever. Yeah, there's um, the shot again. But getting something like that, it, it's just a little momentum boost. It, mm -hmm. It's a little something that, that gives you that hope. Um, and it just Ooh. feels like Hugs has been feeling playing a little more confidently. Yeah, yeah. You see, I mean, like that down smash and neutral right there, just hard reading the run in from Rishi. Yeah, doing it with some wave lands. Just feel like he's he's having a bit more fun oh. now, and um, it just looks like it's his game to lose at this point. We'll see what Rishi can do to to take the stock. Obviously, Sam is at high percent. Just one hit here or there. Oh, no jump now from Hugs. Oh, wow. beautiful. Yeah, that was a three-piece, just precise everything he needed to do to get the kill. He did it. Oh, no, no. jump. Huh. That would have been, uh, that could have been something. Yeah, for sure. Oh, nice edge cancel there from Hugs. He went for that and missed it earlier in the set, but has it on point now. Okay, Rishi. Rishi's really comfortable taking center, which is important. <gasps> wow. 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 What a tap. <laughs> and the I love immediate, the fear. Yeah, the immediate uh, bear to get him momentum, right, okay. too, which is important. Oh, save okay. the jump, but Hugs, good edge guard. And uh, still keeping his lead. Yeah, man, Hugs has been able to read when Rishi is approaching, and that's made a huge difference in this game. A little grab battle. Marth, much better grab than Samus. Oh, okay. Oh, he will absolutely take that. Yeah. Again, that percentage so, so huge. Barely, barely not dying. Yeah, but, but I think he might still be dead here. No, he's got, he's got oh, okay, I wasn't sure the tether was going to reach. Not the tipper that he needed? No. Rishi looking for a bear right now. Yep. Hugs is just being tricky. Oh, I didn't know he had the tether again, huh? Yeah, yeah. There's that bomb. Oh, okay. I think a down smash would have sent him off, but... Yeah, interesting that he went for the getup attack. I mean, being at over 100% makes that setup a lot harder for Samus in general. All right, no tether right now. He's going to have to up B. Oh, I don't it. think yeah. he's got it, yeah. All right, but really good stuff from Hugs. Just surviving as long as possible, getting hits here and there. And now uh, Richie's got a lot to come back from, but giving these hits. Wait a second. Yeah. How does Samus get down? Well, not like that, because you take a lot of damage. In the corner. Okay, they switch sides. Yeah, this is essentially even again. Um, Hugs keeping center. If he can keep center for the rest of the game. What a read. It. Yeah. Wow, oh. getting punished for doing a forward tilt. Just imagine. Oh, that's not the wave land he wanted. <gasps> that was going to break shield, maybe. Close enough that Hugo had to drop through and get hit. Oh, no. Is it going to end wow. the same way? But Rishi charges too long, and a now he's off stage. A little too long, man. A little bit. This is, this is just as tight as last game, but... Hugs is fighting for his life. Rishi's just trying to get oh, the Oh, that's it! Wow! He's off a tipper out of nowhere. 